Hi, I'm Jessica, and I'm the funny one. She is the funniest <laughs> one. <laughs> it's because we're married. So if she's funny, it just makes me funnier, and so forth. So. Welcome to another Family Flips unboxing. Yep. Uh, today we have a mystery box of electronics from Market Street Liquidation. I like them. I like Mike. And uh, we paid $2.69. We used our 10% coupon code, which you can also use. There's a link down in the description to the website, also the coupon code. We paid $2.42.10 for it. So our goal is to be able to double our money after listing fees. Yeah. After, I don't know. Our goal is to, <laughs> <laughs> that's not what I wanted to say. So. Uh, I was like, that's yes. not what we said, but no, okay. it's not. So our goal is to be able to double our money after shipping fees, after selling fees, and after labor. So our goal is to get at least $600 in revenue after shipping and fees to make this box worthwhile. Will we do it? I don't know. We'll find out. Let's do it. Hi there, my name is Joe. And I'm Jessica. We are homeschooling natural living entrepreneurs. This is a story of how we balance it all for the freedom to live our lives devoted to our family and faith. Thanks for stopping by. Subscribe and come on in. Do it. There's a lot of stuff in this box that I already recognize. Yeah. So that's comforting because I know how much they sell for and I'm feeling pretty confident about what's in this box. But I did not recognize this and I thought it was kind of cool. It's a uh, teach your kids to stay in bed machine. Ah, oh, we need one of those. We do need one of those. <laughs> uh, I don't know um, how it works. It is some Chinese branded something. And it's got, I mean, it's perfectly sealed inside. So I guess you open it, you plug it in, and somehow maybe there's some kind of alarm or some kind of trigger that lets them know, hey, like, I can get out of bed you now. can get out of bed now. Um, so it looks Wouldn't really nice. Wouldn't that just nice. be an alarm clock? I mean, I guess if they wake yeah. up, you know. I, get, I don't know. That's why. Who what, knows? I might have to look into this. Yeah. This may not go for sale because we we may try to implement something like this. Yeah. I don't know. Our kids are just morning, morning birds. They are. And they don't like to go to bed at night. So I think that's no. just all kids, maybe? maybe? I don't know. All right. I'm going to grab this. It's a Ninja battery. And uh, it's probably going to be for a computer. And uh, that's good to see. That's encouraging. It looks to be still sealed in the box, which is awesome. Because if it was a return, which, to let you know, this, uh, this box, it's a mix between brand new shelf pull items and customer returns mm -hmm. so they mix them well mm -hmm. and uh if you're interested if you see something that we unbox you're like "Ooh, i want that well there's a link down in the description to our website where you can use uh where you can look at the collection the items just from this unboxing as well as our other other items for sale so yeah computer battery not this glamorous but that's money and i'm liking it there's like a yeah. lot of like really good christmas items in here um which I love because yeah. it is that time of year. But this is a, a professional hair clipper set. Cream, cream, Keen? Keen West? Keen West? Um, I hope it hasn't been used. I say that for every <laughs> every well, item that may be returned. This looks promising. Yes. It's This is still sealed. Um, it's got a carrying case, I guess, if you want to take it to travel with you. No hairs, no hairs. And these are all over the place, but... Could just I'm, be from loose. Yeah, I'm not seeing any signs of use at all. It no. doesn't even look like they've been put on the clippers. And the clippers look... I, there's no way to make this camera focus on the inside of this, but they look perfectly Pristine. fine. Pristine. They look great. Yay! So, that's a good yep. sign. All right, Winner, cool. winner. Let me grab all this stuff. I'm going to grab a couple of items here. Looks like we have an out... It's a, an outlet... La 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 it la is. la. Whatever. It is say. a wall mount for an Echo, which is one of those like it's like an Alexa or oh, um, right. the Google, the Home Dot, whatever it is. It's one of those little holders. It's probably only going to be like five or six dollars. And then we have uh, this Fairywell Sonic Electric toothbrush. We got one the last unboxing, 
and uh, it wasn't used. This one, the box is torn, but it has not been, I say it hasn't been used because I saw the, uh, see it's down, it's still sealed down the bottom, so like, I'm gonna have to do it, but you can see it's still like the toothbrush stuff is still. Is it pink? Yeah, it's like the little attachment things. Oh, that's neat. Yeah. The one we had was black. Yeah, so I don't know if it's pink. Yeah, it is pink. So, but it sold already for like 20. I think somebody maybe watching our YouTube channel bought it. I think we sold it for like 20 bucks. I think they said like, I'm from your YouTube channel. We like to give discounts to those of you guys who watch. So yep. keep that in mind. If you end up on our eBay store, make sure you shoot us a message to let us know. Yeah, I need one of these. We do. It's a key finder. I, guess I need you... it for my wallet, cell phone, keys. So it looks sanity. like it's got. <laughs> There's no hope for that. Oh, but... you'll never find it. No. no, there there are four different colors here. You can attach them to different stuff, and then I guess you just uh, it's open. So I'm gonna inspect it because it's it has been opened. It looks. It doesn't look to have been used. No, but it looks like there's only two. Oh, they stole some key fobs. No, there no, they are. There. They're underneath. They're underneath. It's no longer brand new. Sorry, sorry. Um, so this is what attaches to your items, which that's so big. These are so big. They are huge. Um, so keep that in mind if you're looking <laughs> for it. That's not going to my wallet very well. No, but then you can like attach them to these little buttons, and you push the button. I guess it makes like a maybe a bloop bloop noise or yeah. a bloop bloop noise. That's a a, beep, bleep, a, a bloop bloop noise. Bleep, bloop. I have no idea. That's my wife. She's amazing. I am amazing. Yeah, we've Thank got a, uh, a magnetic car air vent uh, cell phone holder. Looks like if you uh, put like a little strip on the back of your cell phone and then you put it there, it's like magnetized and like, pew! The, ma the magnet won't mess up the phone? <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> you know, I'm just telling you what it does. No idea what it will do. Um, and this looks to be a charging stand, I guess. Charging stand? Yeah, I mean, it's there and there. <laughs> it's there and there. It's a type, that was, yeah, type C charger. And uh, you see. What does it look like? Oh, you just, it's like a little, you just, whatever you want to charge. There's so much stuff in here. We may not be selling any of this stuff. Dude, these this would is all not make... gonna help our profit potential. <laughs> these would all make great Christmas gifts. So we're already in like Christmas gift shopping for our, our families. So ourselves. We're like, and ourselves. And My, ourselves. me. I want well, this. I, there are things that I'm shopping for. I'm like, hmm, I know somebody who would like that. Oh, not me. <laughs> <laughs> hey, at least you're honest. You need to grab a couple of items because I've got five already. Well, here, you want this? Oh, this one's bigger. Oh. This one's bigger than yours. It's a fairy oh. well, will, fairy will. It's also a toothbrush, but it's, why is it so big? I don't know. It's the same. No, wait. Yeah, it Five is. Five modes. Five modes. It's got the replacement head. I have no idea. It's got a cool carrying case. Maybe that's what's different about it. It's got a cool carrying case because that one does not have a cool carrying case. So how nice. I think we actually this is a, a like say maybe thirty nine dollars. So remember when uh, Whitney was listing it, she had a question about it. She was trying to find it. And I think this one is the nicer model. And then I'll grab this too because these are what I think are headphones. Yes. Right there. And so no this ear one. Wax. No earwax. Well, I'm trying to figure out. Okay, it's a magnetic box. This is really nice. Like, this is like a really nicely packaged set yeah. of headphones. It hasn't been opened in here. Uh, yeah, wait, hold on. I can lift it up. I can lift it up. You lift me up. up. There's dirt on here, but I don't think it's earwax. There's like white dust on here. Hmm. Um, so we'll test them, we'll charge them, test them, and clean, clean them. them. And then that's the head, it's like yeah. a, a case, but it's also a charger. Yeah. So that's pretty cool. If I'm gonna, I'm gonna look into it a little bit more when I price it. Um, and then of course, you know, our listing agents will have yeah. to look into it as well. So I'm always like, I always get bummed when I see headphones and then the used headphones because those headphones a lot of times like the one ear will stop sinking yes uh and like they send it back you know how it goes so i guess that's five and five all right well let's press these real quick and we'll be right back oh i just was gonna try and have that so i don't look at a a thing oh, okay 
All right, so the first item I have is this mount holder, the little magnetic one that it says you can put on the phone. There's lots that are selling like this, so I assume it's safe to put on your phone. Uh, but they're only selling for like three, four, five dollars a piece on eBay. There's no way that we can make any money. So we'll sell it either in a, a lot and have it for like a dollar or we'll sell it at a garage sale for a dollar. And then we have the Fairy Well toothbrush, the pink one, the five mode toothbrush. These are selling for like $20.99. Uh, we'll price ours probably $20.99. Uh, sell it, you know, $20, make around $12 profit for it. Then we have the Ams Trade, the holder for an Echo Dot. These are actually selling for uh, uh, around $8. Uh, there's some that are on another place that are selling for like $12, but on eBay, $8. So we will sell this on eBay because it's not a real popular like Echo Dot, like trying to sell it at a garage sale. It's just a much smaller pool of people. So we'll try and sell online, make $2. We have the Ninja battery. It's for a Dell Inspiron computer, some model. Uh, they're selling for $22 to $31. So we're gonna price ours somewhat in the higher end of the middle at $27.99 and get $18 potential profit. And then the last item is that little cool little type C charging stand. Uh, we'll price it for $9.99. I couldn't find, it's really hard to, to find it because of USB-C charging stand. There is so many items on eBay that were listed. So we don't have a screenshot for this one, but they're selling six, seven, eight, nine dollars So we'd make $2 uh, if we sell it online. Okay, so my turn. The first thing I have is the sleep training alarm clock. I did find this on Amazon. It was unavailable, um, but the pink one was selling for somewhere around $24. I did also find these on eBay. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna sell ours for $19.99, and if we do, we'll be able to get $12 off of this guy. Um, this is the professional hair clipper set. Um, it's selling for $35 on eBay, so we'll list ours for $34.99. Hope to make $25, potentially. Um, and then this guy with the, um, you know, it's the same as what Joe had, but this one's a little bit more of like a, a gift set, I guess, or like a kit, because it does have the travel case in it. These were selling anywhere from $30 to $35. Most of them were selling on the lower end of that. So we're gonna list ours for $30.99, and uh, after shipping and fees, we should be able to make a good $22 off of that. Um, and then this one, the key finder. So <laughs> I found these exact ones on Amazon selling for $20, which I think is absolutely crazy because when I comped similar non-branded key finders on eBay, they were only selling for five to $10, which seems a little more realistic to me. Um, obviously this packaging is a little broken, even though the items inside are still pretty good. So I'm just gonna sell this locally. We'll put this in a garage sale for maybe $2 or so, and we'll just call that done. Somebody will have a really great deal on something like this. And then finally, the um, Inac Fire. Inac Fire, I think that's the brand, E-N-A-C-F-I-R-E, Inac Fire. Um, headset, headphones, earbuds. That's what the words are, they're earbuds. I was gonna get there, I was gonna get there. So these are selling anywhere for 30 to $35 brand new. Um, we cannot sell them brand new because we're gonna have to clean them and I would rather give a discount and sell them used rather than to risk lying to a potential customer. So I'm gonna sell ours somewhere between 20 to $25. I'm not sure where, but I do hope to make at least $15 um, after these are all said and done and if they work, because we do have to test them first. So, I think that's good. I think we're good, I think that's it. Do you want me to do a, a, a price total? Nah, I mean, the middle one. Okay. I feel like my head's a little bit cut off. I'm gonna adjust this slightly. There we go. That can be up in your face. It's not even recording. Yes, it is. Oh, it is. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I have a box. This is what Jesse. And then I always say, I hope it, I hope it works. I don't know. Just when you do so many of these and you watch them, you're like, you see all the little things that, I don't know. I think that's normal. Yeah. That's normal behavior. What so is, this. 
I don't understand. That's it? That's all that's in there? Looks like it's battery operated. It's gotta be a clock that's broken or something. Solar powered fountain pump. Ah. But it looks like it has been used before. Now that you say that, looks like there's water. I don't know if you can see it, but there's like water little droplets that have been dried. Oh, maybe you could put it in like a bird bath. Yeah. So so my like, ah, oh, that makes more sense. Because it like, definitely doesn't go in like a lake. Yeah. So <laughs> solar powered, so it gets the sun. Then it's got the little pump here. So then it. Do birds even like? Maybe not a bird bath, maybe like a garden. I have no idea. I don't know. But it doesn't look too high tech or high quality. I always pick the stuff with the brighter color. Every time I look down, you I do. the brighter colored ones always get me. This is B B excellent. Is that a wired one? It looks wired. It does look wired. Yeah. It's, it doesn't say it's wireless, so it's a pro gaming headset. Definitely uh, off brand. It has been opened, so. I'm going to look inside and make sure it's not like completely damaged. Um, definitely a used item. It is wired. Yep. It's still really nice. It's got the little thing on here. I'm looking at the ears. I don't see any like hair or people products. That's good. So that's good. It still will need to be cleaned. They may um, have bought it thinking that it was wireless and they had the wires and they tried to like it, but they just couldn't like it. You just never know, yeah. but as long as it works, we'll test it out, um, yeah. and it will sell. It will. It will. All right. Got one box I know, one box I don't. We've got, we've had one of we these so before, of those, yeah. and we've sell them. Uh, we've sell them. We'll, we sell them. We have sold them, <laughs> I was trying to say. <laughs> we have sold them, and we sell them. But it's LED mirror, and then we have a brown box. Brown box? We have a box. We have a box. And uh, it's like a battery of some sort, which I like batteries. You do, it's really weird. Because it's, they sell. I People know, it's always, funny. I get excited about the items and I'm like, oh, yep, I know that's gonna sell and it's gonna sell like within a week or two. I get excited about those items uh, because that's, you know, that's money, cha-ching. I just like the things that look pretty. I like the things that sell fast. I like the things that sell fast, but I get excited about the things that look pretty. Yeah. I think this is probably another battery. Is this the same as yours? Oh, you got yeah. two of them. Sweet, even better. <laughs> <laughs> I have a Satinel Advanced Wet and Dry Appellator for no legs, use. body, and no use. face. No use. Say oh. with me, not been used, not been used, not been used. Not been used. Not been used! Looks great. Uh, it's got all the parts here. I'll have to double check and make sure all the parts are still there. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't think that was gonna happen. Still there. <laughs> I didn't think that was gonna happen. So what do you do with it? You shave. With that thing? <laughs> Crap! Did you see that thing? Like, like just, why would you put that on you? It's like blades and rows of teeth. What the crap? And you put that on your legs? Yeah, look. You women, y'all go through <laughs> some pain, some stuff to, you know. I mean, look, you can see. And on she's the like, oh yeah, this is amazing. I mean, she looks really content. This must not hurt that bad. That's crazy. Yeah. But at least it hasn't been used. New open box. And we know it works. And we know, well, we know it. I you don't want to test it on my skin. I'll test it on you. No, you give will your, not. Give me your arm, I'll test no, it. No, because then it's not, not been, it's not new anymore. Oh, that's why. That is why. We have some headphones, looks to be sealed right here. I don't know about the top. Where are you laughing at now? I just really didn't expect that thing to turn on. I didn't either. So there. <laughs> hey, Ollie. Have y'all met Ollie? Hold on, let me go get him one. These look to have been used. There's some scuffs on the case there. And, uh... Have y'all met Ollie? He doesn't like to come out for filming and stuff, so we don't always have him on the vlogs, but he's a good kid. Yeah. 
He, he's been uh he's, he's been hunting he's been out here he's been bringing us beetles and spiders and all kinds Couple of stuff. rats i didn't even know we had rats we, not rats we, mice mice whatever they were They're field mice it's field mice you know when it starts to get cold little mice that live out in the fields like which our backyard is kind of like a field it's up by a back a field they come in they try to find warm and he got them well i didn't even know we had any yeah and we definitely don't have any now <laughs> yeah so i don't know like they don't look the ear the earbud parts don't look to have been used but there's scratches on it so it, it's definitely we can't sell it as as brand new uh or even new open box we can probably sell it like good cosmetic condition great cosmetic condition uh so here you go does go oh. in there yeah. This is an RGB, I guess red, green, blue cabinet light. Oh. So they go. Ah, we may be keeping that. Joseph. What? We're trying to sell stuff here. Sorry, business is doing okay. You know. You can set the color and oh, he's gonna want this. Yeah, for for filming. Yeah, he's gonna want he's because it has all different colors and you can just set the light according to whatever color, whatever ambiance you want and. <gasps> There's several lights in there. There are six of them. Oh, <gasps> that's amazing. And there are two remotes. Y'all will see this in a future vlog. So we're not selling this. We'll I tell guess. you how much it could sell for so that you would know. He's crazy. There's so many headphones in here. <laughs> We've sold those. We've had those. We've had these. Yep. And they and, sold pretty uh, good. Box is sealed. I'm super excited. <laughs> So we got this in the last Market Street Mystery Box liquidation, mm. and um, these are, they're selling for $129.99. Uh, we had ours listed for a little over 24 hours. I, I think we sold it for $116.99 because I ran a sale and I forgot to exclude this. So it sold for $117 within 24 hours of being listed. Yeah. So that's almost half the box right here being paid for with this. And, I'm and that so looks excited. even, that looks like an even better condition one than yeah. before. So I'm that excited. Is, that is really cool. I'm sorry, Ollie. Don't step on my baby. Sorry, He's buddy. fine. He's fine. He gave he, us a dirty he, look and left. He's dead. He's <laughs> fine. He's, he's fine. Just a flesh wound. <laughs> I step on him. Okay, so he's the exact same color as my kitchen floor. So you gotta be really careful because uh -huh. when he lays down and I'm like cleaning the counters or whatever and I back up, I don't even see him. But he's he's such a good kitty, guys. He is. I did, I'm not even a cat person, but he's such a good kitty. Lucy wanted a cat for so long. And after like a year of asking for a cat, like every couple of weeks. This you guy, know, kids. This guy, he came from a family who has had kids and dogs, but they couldn't have as many. Cats yeah, and they had moved. They were very picky, and we we got chosen yeah. of multiple families. So I felt very honored about that. Yeah. But we love him. He's so cute. So cute. So cute. Okay, I got another one. This is called Sweet LF. Sweet love, like friends. Sweet yeah. like friends. Well, you know AF. You know, LF, I don't know. But it seems like I'm getting all the headphones, you're getting all the razors and trimmers and stuff. Not used, not used, not used. I don't know, babe. It looks like it. I don't know. No, no, it looks better than its packaging yeah. did. Yeah. <gasps> I knew that one. I knew it was <laughs> going to, that was dramatic effect. <laughs> Add a little suspense. No, babe, if I, I, why do I need that for this little bit of hair right here, that right there, and right here? I actually, I use... You should ask him. Y'all should ask him to shave him, shave his beard again. He looks like a baby. No, I don't want to do it. He looks like a but baby. But I use a little electric trimmer like that. It's a single row uh, <laughs> that we got off of a pallet, I don't know, two years ago. Um, I use it to... Uh, oh, it was in there, One it? more for you, and then that's five and five. Oh. I think I've got one, two, three, four, five, yeah. How'd I don't you know how I, because I'm grabbing two at a time for some of these and you just keep grabbing one. Oh, here, I'll grab two. But then you'll be up one. Oh well, too bad. Jackery, <gasps> we've got one. We have one of these, it's perfectly sealed. Yep. It's a pretty good price if I remember correctly. It's just a an outdoor battery charger yeah. for Apple products. So I like this, this will be easy. I'll let you know. I'm gonna look it up because it may have changed Prices may change yeah. since the last time, um, but that's pretty simple. And then this is a foldable wireless keyboard. Didn't you want one? I do, but I want the wireless keyboard mouse combo. Oh, uh, okay. That's what I want. Okay, but this is really small. Um, 
Well, it's foldable, so it's. I know. I just think it's cool that it's. I just That's think it's cool that it's small. Super tiny. I think it's cool. It must be for like a tablet or something. It's it's sealed. I won't open yeah. it. It's completely sealed. It hasn't even been opened. There's no way for me to open it without messing up the seal. You'll see in the picture. How many times am I gonna say that? A little bit. I don't know. It's you been know. sealed. It's never been opened. It's never been opened. So it's because it's, it's sealed. Been sealed. So I'm not gonna open it because it'll mess up the right. seal. <laughs> Just in case. Because you... it's never been opened. Because <laughs> it's sealed. Because it is sealed. <laughs> <laughs> let's just let's just go. All right. So the Trenya, Trenya B530 Pro headphones. There's actually been some used ones sold. I had the most recent ones in the screenshot sold for $23.99. New ones are selling for like 30 bucks, so that's not that much of a price differential. So we'll go ahead and price ours for $23.99. Hopes to make $14 profit once it sells. We've got the LED mirror. There's lots that have been selling for, you know, $12, $13, $16. Uh, we'll price ours for $13.99. Hopes to get $6 profit. This guy, the uh, little solar sprinkler thing, zero dollars. We're not gonna even try to sell it or test it. And then we have these two batteries that we found. It's for a, Bo a Bose SoundLink 3 replacement battery. They're selling anywhere from 26 to $35 a piece. Uh, we will list ours for $29.99. Should get $20 profit, because that may take some best offers, but so we'll count $20 profit. So that's $40 profit between the two. And the high one of the round was this blue parrot uh, headphone thingy. $125, $135, that's what they're selling for. So we'll price ours for $129.99, and uh, I'll accept an offer and uh, hopes to make $100 profit. So that's $160 profit for my items that round, which is amazing. Good job. Now, ready in action. All right, so it's my turn. Um, I've got the Be Excellent headset. They're not super pricey headsets, of course. Um, I, I could kind of, I kind of guessed that. But uh, so these are $20 brand new. These are obviously not brand new, so I would have to take at least 50% off. And then we just really wouldn't profit at all selling these online. Therefore, um, I'm just gonna sell them for like $3 at a garage sale. Somebody's gonna get a really, really good deal for those. Then I have the uh, women's epilator shaver razor thing um new open box which is what this is they're selling around 60 dollars, maybe a little bit less so i'm gonna list ours for 59.99 um, and i'm probably gonna get like 45 dollars off of this just because it's a little heavy and a little bulky so there'll be more fees associated with that so um the cabinet lights now i know that joe wants to keep these um but I did find them online. They're selling for $25. So if we were to sell them, we would make $18 in potential profit after shipping and fees for this one. Um, and then I have Sweet LF Men's Razor. I don't know why I did this. Like, I don't think anybody really shaves their forehead. But hey, if you do, you do you. Um, this is $35. I was selling for about $35, new open box. So I'm gonna go ahead and list it for around the same. Um, and then we should be able to make maybe $25. It's a little bit heavier, so shipping's gonna be a little bit more on this guy. So $25. Um, and then this one, the price stayed consistent from the last time that I unboxed this. So they're selling brand new. This is completely brand new, completely sealed for $20 online. So if I list it, it's going to be super easy because I think I still already have the listing so we can just change the quantity on that and we should be able to make a potential $13 here, which is very exciting and very cool. Um, so this is a very, very small keyboard. Um, and so when I, when I looked it up, it was kind of hard to find, but I did find this exact one. I did have a screenshot for it. Um, and it's selling for, I think $18, um, maybe a little bit less but if I list it for $18 I should be able to make $10 in profit which means that all six of these items all together for me is about $114 which isn't a grand total um, and it isn't like super exciting but it is very consistent so I'm happy with it what do y'all think so far? <laughs> <laughs> what? what do y'all think so far? like 
I, like it. I like it. I don't yeah. think, you know, it's not like this, like, oh, wow, amazing yeah. box with all these really cool things. But, you know, we've had pretty, each round we've had a pretty consistent amount. It's consistent money. You know, and it's like, it's so, it's one of those where it's like, you know, this isn't, I don't know, there might be more in here that's like, wow, awesome. Yeah. But like this, I'm comfortable with and I feel good about it for the business because right. I know that these items will sell. Um, I know that we're pricing them well. And so, yeah. You're making a mess, babe. <laughs> Come on. It's a lightweight portable photo partner. Come on. <laughs> Coleman? Oh. That's where my brain goes. <laughs> it's a lightweight portable selfie stick. It's tripod. a tripod selfie stick. Nice. This box is like not my friend. No. Um, no, we don't need that. Yeah, this box is not my friend, but you know, it's got the instructions. It's got a little clicker so you can like, you know, this can, this can hold your phone. And then this must be the tripod, and yep. it looks like it's in per it's in great condition. The box is the box is in our friend, but the that'll make a great Christmas present. Oh yeah, for sure, especially for like the starting vlogger yeah. or something like that who you don't you don't have like a lot of heavy equipment. Yep. But this this would be a good start. Yep. And it looks like I've got something similar to it, but it has no box. Sad. I know. So I have no idea, um, you know, finding out the brand, any of that stuff. Oh yeah, that's true. Um, it's got the little case. Oh, it's a ring light. Oh. That's what it is. It's so little. This may never leave the house. Do we need another ring light? In the bedroom, like when I uh, film back there. Why didn't you just there? use our ring light? Because it's so big. But it works fine, you're... We don't know what brand this is. This can be so hard to sell. Oh, it is. <laughs> <laughs> It's new though. He's gonna purposely not be able to find the brand. Oh, uh, you be size. <laughs> but we'll have to sell it new without the box. It's got a little mount for cell phone if you wanna do that. It's got a little clicker, all those little things. And the tripod here. So, <laughs> so that's it. And it gets really... This is why we buy electronics mystery boxes so Joe can have fun. Yep. That's yep. it. We don't need it. What do we need it for? You you don't vlog every day like I do. I don't vlog every day either. I used to, but not every day now. Four days a week, maybe five. What do you guys think? Should he be able to keep it? Let me know in the comments. One to keep don't, it. Don't don't do the one no. and two. Because we always forget. We here's look what in the comments and we're like, what did wait question did so we So here's what happens. Joe will say <laughs> one if this, two if this, and then we get all these comments of one and two, and I'm like, Joe, what are they talking about? And we don't remember. Because some, like, some of these unboxings we film like you know weeks before it ever comes out. And we've already forgot. So just let me know like Yes, he can keep it. No, he shouldn't. I will know what that means. Don't do the numbers. The numbers make no sense to me. And then I have to try and like rack my brain and try to remember what. <laughs> Some of you added three or four in there just to like throw the confusion in there. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Ooh. Flex LED strips. I, I don't like, need those. I like LED strips. They do. They always sell well. And uh, as long this as. This has been definitely tried out or yeah. used. Like this. You know, when it comes from the manufacturer, it's not going to just be thrown in no. here like this. So we may have to plug it in and make sure they turn on. Yeah. Um, but they, they're not super, super pricey, but they are, um, you know, consistent sellers. Yeah, I man, that probably there's like 30 bucks, yeah. maybe, maybe 40 because it's longer. Uh, I don't know how long these but are. But sometimes people will take it out and they can't figure out they want to use it or they, sometimes the remotes are not very good either. So. I've got a smartwatch. Ooh. Just a uh, Elfon smartwatch, Android for men, women's kids, for men's and women's kids. <laughs> <laughs> you can do it. I was told to make, I should make faces like Jessica, so. <laughs> do I make faces like that? No, I don't. I do not. I have normal faces. What do y'all think, people? One phrase? <laughs> I can't get it out. I'll expect this later. <laughs> Ten years later, he cannot get it out. Yeah. These are Everlight FX USB rechargeable, some kind of light. They look cool. They look like they're safety lights, but I don't know. I don't know. I don't think they've ever been opened. I don't want to open it because it's it like... It looks clean. 
Like, I mean, it's like in there. So yeah. I'm afraid I might rip the box if I open it. The stuff is in the box? Uh, it's got 12 to 40 hour battery life. I don't know what, I guess you just like, oh, you attach it to your shoe around your ankle. And or so you your can, wrist. Or your wrist. Well, I just see on here. Yeah, this and guy's, on the other side, it's the wrist. So you, it's like for running. It's ah. like safe, like when you're outside in the dark, people can see you. Mm. Oh, oh, sorry. That is nice. You know what also is nice is Impow. Impow. That's the brand name. These are like $39.99 as long as it hasn't been used. Like we this we we got these one of the last unboxings we got from Market Street and it sold within 24 hours also. It looks good. And uh I think it's been taken out of the box before, but I'm not seeing any signs of use or anything. Mm -hmm. So new open box, maybe sell it for $34.99. $34.99, are you out of your mind? Yes. <laughs> Can't find my sanity. That's why we got those GPS thingies. He's very unique, guys. I've got these two things here. This one is a slim leather case. Quality for, for your iPad. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Help me. <laughs> Help me. Uh, Borion. Just for a 9.7 inch screen. Looks like it's for an older model iPad, but it will still sell on the eBay. I'm opening. 10 to $15, I'm guessing. I'm opening this unidentifiable, like there, you can't, be, you have no idea what it is. No idea what it is? But it's a keyboard. It's actually Ooh. a pretty keyboard. It's like a rose. Babe, stop throwing You stuff. always do that. It's like a rose. Babe. You're always like shooting stuff, dropping inserts out. It's a, it's a small sized rose gold colored keyboard. It's really pretty. I like that. It is. Too small though. Be nice for like a, a tablet, a MacBook tablet, or, or like not a, a MacBook, but an a iPad tablet. Tablet, yeah. or like a um, like travel because it's so small. Yeah, it'd be a good one to keep. Yeah. All right. How many do I have? Do one more. I grab two items. No, you can't grab two. But then I only have three items. You. You can't. I'm just messing with you. you. Have five. I, I'm trying to mess with you, but I can't. I have a power bank, USB charger thing. I guess you can charge it in your cigarette lighter, which is convenient, and take it with you. I don't need any more charging banks, but I like it, and I don't know why. why? Are you gonna are you gonna be okay? <sighs> My fingers are not working today. I can't get this one out of the box either. What is that? <laughs> what is this? <laughs> Enjoy the so. Oh, okay. Y'all can't see. There you go. Whoa, whoa, <laughs> oh my gosh, it's like one of those. Oh, yes, <laughs> that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> you know, the like little Dragon Ball Z thingies. Pick it. <gasps> oh, it changed. That's yellow now. Purple. Wow! <laughs> Rainbow! I have no idea what it's called. <laughs> Nothing on the box, it's just a white box. That's it, it's five and five. <laughs> so the ring light, um, it's an eight inch ring light and they're selling for like 30, 30 to 35 dollars, somewhere around in there. So if we sell it, we'll price it at 32.99, hopes to get around 20 dollars for it. Uh, but I like it. And then we have the USB power bank. You could charge it in your car and then take it with you. $12.95 it's selling for, and it has sold for that price. So that's what we'll do also. Should bring us $5 profit once it sells. We've got the smart watch, no glare. There we go. Uh, it's selling for anywhere from like 20 to $25. We'll price ours at $19.99. Should make $12 on it. Then we have the Impow Pro Bluetooth headset. This is a different model than the one I was thinking of, but they're still selling a lot. So anywhere from 29 to 30 something dollars, like 39 bucks they're selling for. We'll price ours at $32.99 and get $24 uh, after shipping and fees. All right guys, so the first thing that I pulled out on this round was the tripod doohickey thing. Um, so this is selling for about $40 new open box. This is new open box. We'll just have to 
fix the box, replace the box because the tripod inside is actually perfect. So we'll sell, we'll sell that. We'll hope to get uh, $25 for this. The Everlight safety lights for when you go running out in the dark, these are selling for about $25. So I'm hoping to be able to make 18 after it's all said and done. Um, and these flex lights, I, I wanted to point something out with these because when I was searching for these, I found these exact brand and I took a screenshot of it. It's selling, for, it was selling for $65 online, which you could look at it and be like, oh my gosh, that's awesome. That's great. But always make sure that you take time to look at what is, what's sold. Cause anybody can put a price on any listing and it'll show up. But really what you want to know is how much did it actually sell? sell for um, and I attached another listing here which has the list of all the things that have sold and they're all selling consistently at $35 which is a very is a much more realistic price so we're gonna list ours for 30 uh, $34.99 um, hoping to make somewhere between 20 to 25 dollars um, these are kind of heavy so shipping may eat some of that cost but I just want to let you know just a little tidbit for you um, okay, so I had this keyboard and then I had this um, This little leather case these actually I'm actually pretty lucky they, they were right next to each other So it made sense when I pulled them out, but these actually go Together as a set and it took me for way longer than I would like to admit to figure that out but these actually go together and they actually sell as a set. So we're going to sell ours for $39.99, very comparative to what it's selling for online. And we hope to make $28 altogether for this. So very exciting. So all of my batch together is $101. Not bad. Pretty consistent. <clears throat> all right, Joe. So I've done the numbers and we've each done three batches. All right. All right. Three rounds. So we're 30 items in roughly. Roughly. Uh, so we've got probably maybe one or two more rounds left, right. um, but we are already at $547. Nice. So remember our goal was around $600 yeah. because we were all in um, at around somewhere around two, what? Two, 246, 240. Somewhere around I don't there. Know, $240 range. You know, we've already, as we've been pricing the items, we've already been taking off an estimated shipping and selling fees. Yeah. We will have at the very end to take off labor fees, how much it's going to cost to pay people to help us list it. Um, but we're hoping by the end of this unboxing that we hit $600. And if it continues the way that we we've had it, we've got it in the bag. Yeah. Let's keep do. going. All right. All right. All right. I'm going to pull this one right, right. here. Uh, another, uh, Arctic. Key, Artec, Artec. Okay, Artec, Artec. Is right. It's a backlit Bluetooth keyboard. Right. So, you know, and every time I've been pricing keyboards, I have noticed, because um, I've priced, I think, two of them already. You have been getting lots of keyboards and razors. Yes, but the, the black light ones tend to sell for more. Yeah. So even though this is not a huge, like, uh, oh, this is cool. You can actually change the color Ooh. of it, like green or blue or red so that's pretty cool so i'm interested Neato. to see how much this sells for it probably won't be like huge dollar but it'll be good so i've got another one of these m headphones oh yeah and um somebody had commented and i i don't know it was late at night i just remembered there's like a master there's like some really nice headphones that may have this so i'm gonna look into that and see uh what do you mean there's a really nice something. headphones somebody commented on the last unboxing video of them about the end they're like you better not hope it's such and such because we talked about just getting rid of it yeah because then they said some brand and i forgot the brand so i'll have to go back and check it see this is why i love you yeah. guys for but put, for i could kind of determine out. whether it is or not but it could be um, it could be. And then three trees. Three trees. Is there professional three trees in there? lighting? USB rechargeable. Ah, okay. So it's a light that you put on your head. Oh, okay. When you go cave diving, sprout spelunking, hiking in the that. dark. You got yeah. Hey, did you ever tell you about the one time that he almost got attacked by a what was it? A cougar. Ma a cougar uh, no, mountain no, lion. Mountain lion. I did. 
Yeah, well, that's it's what you possible. Get. That's what they you say. Get. There's not mountain lions in Arkansas. I think it's so they don't spread fear. But there's definitely mountain lions in Arkansas. <laughs> there's too many sightings uh, in instances Sounds. where like there's mountain lions. For sure. Yeah. It's a box. <laughs> <laughs> and there's nothing on it. It's a box. What is this? What is this? What is this? Oh, it's a five port HDR HDMI switcher. And I should have got some other stuff in here. It's five port HDR. It's like an off brand, but these are usually 20 to 30 bucks. They usually always sell. They have always sold. Um, always, always, always sold. sold. Yeah. I've got some more headphones. We got lots of, do we have any more headphones in here? I'm just gonna grab a couple of the headphones. Headphones? We got headphones. We got some jogger headphones. We've got skull candy headphones here. We've got some J3 headphones. And that's some headphones. More headphones. These are not going anywhere near eBay. Because uh, they, look, close. they look too much like Apple and they will and more flag headphones those dudes. right here. So I just grabbed a bunch of items. I know. That's okay. Every item that I've got is headphones except for the three trees. I have an air duster. Oh. Very interesting. Joe wants it. That's why he said that. I mean, I always need to blow dust like a key, out of keyboards when we're listing stuff just and there's dust you. on things. Like this would be a great we actually tool do for the need reselling business. It's got to be charged, I guess. Look, it's got a this one and then this one. Except for Lucas can never. Does it work? Yes. Let me get your nose. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> price it for you since we are children and we can't do anything act like an adult here jessica <laughs> always playing it's a fun toy i'll let you do some headphones well i have to put this up it's your turn i've been just grabbed like thirty-seven thousand items well that's your fault now you gotta look up thirty-seven thousand. items. i know you know <laughs> it's like i'm just trying to you know we do one more here's a projection alarm clock i guess this is one of those it shoots the light up onto the ceiling so when you're really tired and you don't want to know you're what like, time it is oh what time is it you can just be like oh, oh. okay five more minutes <laughs> kind of i think it's like that um and then i have a multifunctional fan hong ski yes multifunctional fan <laughs> let's price these all right all right so these M headphones, I can't find the comment. I can't find them. I've done Google Lens search. I'm pretty sure they're not the brand that that lady was talking about. Um, so I don't even know, a dollar or two. There's lots of headphones in this lot that we're going to end up lotting up. And uh, I don't know where we'll sell. I'll probably try and sell on eBay, but all of these, they're all like eight, $9 a piece. Uh, brand new and it's not going to bring us much uh they just they don't sell very fast there's so many headphones out there on ebay that we'll slot it up with other headphones that we have maybe like a small electronic slot sell it on ebay for people that do garage sales or flea markets so really the only two items that were worth any money and they weren't even really worth a whole lot of money was the uh this is a true wireless sound brand j3 they're selling for like 18 to 20 dollars sold price at 18.99 should make around like 10 11 12 dollars and then the head thing uh it's on sale for on amazon for like 9.99 right now so if we're to sell it we make around three four dollars so not a big money run for me uh and hopefully we'll be able to lot up all those headphones and get them all out together uh, and make some money off of it. Come on, Desi boy. You should go, boy. I know. Go, go see your daddy. Okay, but I might step on you. I'm just gonna tell you right now, and you're not gonna like that. We're already. I'm sorry. We're. I'm sorry that I'm recording right now. So I have got 
first and foremost, my projection alarm clock. Uh, I found this one on Amazon. It was selling for $28, so after shipping fees, I should be able to make $18 on that. Um, the next thing I had was that HDMI switcher, um, five port switcher. It's selling for $35, uh, pretty consistent. I couldn't find the exact one, so I did t attach a screenshot of one that was very, very similar, but they're all selling for around the same price. So I'm pretty confident that this will sell for the same $35, so we should be able to make 22. And then the uh, Hanski, what did you call it, babe? Hanski? Hanski. Hanski, whatever, whatever it is. Um, this fan, I found one listed for $12. I couldn't find it anywhere else. I couldn't find any other solds. Whatever it is, it's just, it's not a high dollar fan anyway. So I'm gonna go ahead and try and just sell this for a couple of dollars at a flea market. It gets so hot in Arkansas, somebody's gonna be like, oh yeah, I want that. Um, and they'll get a great deal on it. Um, the Artec, Artec backlit Bluetooth keyboard. I was kind of hoping it'd be a little bit more, but pretty typical for off-brand mini keyboards. This one was selling for $18. I should be able to make a solid $10 off of this one. And last but not least, and I know this box is a mess. I don't know why I always pick the boxes that are, are falling apart. But this air duster, Joe and I were like, oh yeah, we could totally use this air duster to clean, um, you know, because we have so many keyboards and just a whole bunch of equipment. This would be really awesome. However, um, this dude is selling and has sold, I have a, a, a screenshot of all the sold listings there, for around $60. And Joe and I were like, we don't need... Crazy. <laughs> we don't need a $60 air blower. We got a vacuum cleaner. Like, I what? Know. We can, we'll f it's fine. <laughs> so, we're just going to sell this dude for $60. Hope to make $45 when it's all said and done. And uh, that's the end of my round. So, we've got one more round to go. Uh, and then we'll give you guys those final numbers. But I'm really liking the way that it's looking. It's sealed. <laughs> we don't want to unseal it. <laughs> It's an ostrich. ostrich for MacBook Pro. <laughs> I don't know. I think it's a charging block for MacBook Pro. Um, ostrich? We always need extra chargers for our MacBooks. I don't know. You, why are you whispering? Why are you whispering, Joe? I don't know. Why am I whispering, Jessica? <laughs> <laughs> we have a uh, iPhone. If yo wax one if you, gabros, what? white classic controllers, it's a uh, wireless adapter. If you, if you, <laughs> if you, <laughs> I have no idea. Don't mind us. We've done a lot of items <laughs> so far. You can always tell we're so professional yeah. when we start. So Not I don't know what it is. Uh, if you wireless adapter. For what? Though? I don't know. We'll find out when I look it up. So many buttons. So many buttons, and you like to push buttons. I do. I do like to push you buttons. You do. True wireless earbuds, not false, false. wireless headbuds, yeah. but true wireless yes. headbuds. Hold on, I'm looking this at this real quick. Let me just. Let me just She's look. looking. Here, we hold that for me. Thanks, friend. It was halfway sealed, like it's been opened Whoa. before. But there is nothing. I mean, these are spotless. Yep. Yeah, these are completely spotless. It's like the spotless. over ear, in ear earbuds. Yeah, did you want to look at them? I'm sorry. I didn't even show you. Yeah. I'm so rude. She didn't. Can't believe we do this for y'all and she and I know. And then it comes in this neat little charging case. As I'm shaming you. I don't know what's gone into me. <laughs> I'll forgive you. Thank you. All right, we have a USB light up dog collar. Cool! Ooh. I had no idea they made these. Desi needs a light-up dog collar. It is large, so it would fit around his neck. Yeah, but Desi needs it. Okay. You, see you get the ring light, I get the dog collar, okay? Even trade. And then we have a rechargeable handheld fan. And it uh, looks like I'm a fan of fans. Yes, she is. <laughs> I'm not. A I'm fan not. Of, I'm not. I'm actually really not a fan of fans because I don't like the wind blowing and touching my skin. Yeah, it's looking like it's never been used before. It's still wrapped up tight, like it comes from the cool. manufacturer. So it's nice. A, it's a be pretty, like a ten, twelve dollar item. I bet you. 
I betcha. Yep. I have an ale. Ale. This is a portable mini speaker. We've done this before, haven't we? I think so. I think the last Market Street box. It's like a accordion style yep. uh, mini speaker. It's it a Bluetooth is. speaker. That's cool. Yep, we've done that before. All right. Smart it's, watch. It's frozen. Uh, it's frozen. Sealed. It's frozen. It's sealed. It's sealed. It's frozen. In uh, it's a real coast casserole. Casserole. It's casserole. Bluetooth <laughs> smart watch. A1 touch screen smart wrist watch with eight gigabyte SD card, two batteries, and screen protector for Samsung, HD, LG, and Android. That's what it is. I have a smart watch too. This one's a crystal three heart rate and activity watch. At least watch. you can see yours from the outside of the box. But mine had been sealed, sealed, unsealed. Yours been sealed? Nope. Hmm. It's been, uh, the little screen protector came off. That used to protect the, the face it's, of the it's watch. It's unprotected. Uh, there's fingerprints on there that aren't mine because yeah. I didn't touch them. So this is definitely used So it will have to be charged and checked. What is that? I don't know what that is. I don't want to touch it uh, Should I be touching this? You're already touching it. I Don't know what that is. You see down in there that little red dot It's like a I don't know Um I don't know what it is, but I'm not going to open it to find out. And no, Tom, I'm not going to smell it. I'm not smelling it. I don't know. That's not, item's not looking good. Power be bear. Power beer. <laughs> well, when you read it upside down, <laughs> the aliens are going to eat. <laughs> it's, a, it's a charger, battery case for an iPhone 7, iPhone yeah. 8 power bear. Uh, it has... I want some power beer. Power beer. Uh, it looks like it's in great nice. condition. So it's got all of the installation stuff in here has not been opened and this charging case looks great. Looks great. I'm actually inspecting it right now. Yeah. Like I'm looking in the mirror or in the mirror. You just never know when you get electronics mystery boxes, uh, how much you stuff you're going to have uh, and whether how much of that's going to be sellable or not. Today we've done, looks like we've done pretty well yeah, so Yeah, I'm far. liking it. It's like we have a Sense Smart Sensor Plush, tracks temperature, humidity over time, regularly updates your smartphone and tablets, and even sends you alerts if there is a problem. All those words on the back. I'm just a spokesperson for Sensor Plush. <laughs> plush? This, is it this? Plush? Push. push. I don't like even sensor know. Sensor Plush? I was like, is it is it padded? That's in my head. That's where it went. It's just like a little box. I don't know if it's very interesting for you. <laughs> if y'all want to see stuff like this, if y'all are even still watching, because you're long into the video by now, but you if might you are well watching and you are wanting to see like inside of this stuff, let us know and we'll take the extra time because we're doing this for you guys. Yeah. And my last item is a wireless 2.4 gig dual mode ultra slim keyboard. I like it, it's right. pretty. It's clever. Eye clever is the name of the brand which is why he said that Bad he thinks of. he's he thinks he's he's being funny but it's actually a very big keyboard it is it's very got big uh, oh and the numbers on the side number pad too i like it we may have to arm wrestle for this <laughs> okay <laughs> <laughs> he says things like we're gonna have to arm wrestle for this but if i want it he's gonna give it to me yes pretty much <laughs> pretty much this is neat this is a mouse what? Yeah. It doesn't look like a mouse on I know. But it's a mouse. It's like the one that you go like this. I'll take it out of the box so you can see um, it. Yeah, because I, I can't. Oh, and once we... Oh. It has been opened before. Let's see. That's interesting. And then he's got the roller here. And then I don't know how you control to get around the screen. Oh, I guess you can still <laughs> go like that. <laughs> that was like a joystick. <laughs> how do you get it to go around the screen? <laughs> you just think it. <laughs> I don't know, y'all. Well, we're a finished unboxing, so we're gonna go ahead and price this. Oh, that. Sorry, it was on. <laughs> 
We'll be right back after these messages. Blinded by the light. I keep pushing the button before I'm ready. I'm sorry. All right. So the last items, the final. Yeah. That if you, it's a wireless adapter for a Nintendo Switch. Uh, and we're gonna price it for $19.99. I'll take some offers. I think $19.99 might be a little high and uh, make $12. We have the rechargeable battery and handheld fan. So the cool thing about it is, is it can also charge your cell phone. So it's a rechargeable battery, charge your cell phone. So you can use the fan and charge your phone at the same time but Ooh. it's only like ten dollars so we may make a dollar or two at a garage sale because i don't even think they're selling for ten bucks probably like six or seven dollars and then we have the the dog collar right uh jessica opened it up and like the usb port broke on it uh, it was only like a five to six dollar collar anyways they're all shipping from china it's the only way that you can actually sell that stuff and make money uh so it's zero dollars because it'd be broken and then we have <laughs> <laughs> we have the smart watch this is on like a 12 13 14 dollar watch it is brand new uh so we'll make four dollars after shipping and fees and then i'm saving this sensor push for the last one because it surprised me um, and then we have this vertical mouse here. They're selling anywhere from like $20 to $30. Uh, this one has been opened up. It doesn't look to have been used, but it has been opened up. We'll test it and make sure it does work, but we'll price it for $19.99 and make around $12 in profit. And this sensor push, this is a $50 item. Wow. Yeah. Uh, and there's lots that are selling for 50 bucks. There's even used ones that are selling for $45. So there's not really a big price increase from used to new, like five, 10 bucks. So we'll price ours for $49.99 new open box uh, and make around $40. So $67 total for my round. Okay. All right, so first item I have is the ostrich charger it is like the regular macbook 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 square looking charger so it's selling for about 16 dollars. so after shipping fees we should be able to make a good 10 dollars for that these uh true wireless earbuds are there's a couple of them listed they're selling for about 19.99 we'll follow suit do the same thing they'll sell um and we'll probably make eleven dollars off of those these right here i couldn't remember what we decided to sell these for um but when i looked them up i mean they're selling anywhere from like ten dollars to twenty dollars so we're gonna try 14.99 um it's kind of cutting it in the middle but then also we'll be able to profit like eight dollars for it which is i feel like it's fair for us um and then these power bear um that's that that phone case charger type deal. Uh, it's selling for $15.99. Um, none have sold yet um, from what I've seen, but I feel like that's a fair price for something like this. So we should be able to make uh, $8 off of this as well. And last but not least is this keyboard. <clears throat> this iClever is not name brand, but they seem to have some pretty good quality stuff. Their reviews seem really good. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and sell this. It's selling for $36. So we'll try and do the same and hope to make uh, $25 in shipping and fees when all is said and done. So that's the last of what we have um, in our box, but this this round for me was a little less than Joe's. Um, he had $65 and I had 62. So now it's time to run the numbers and give you our final tally. Okay guys, listen. So we've been unboxing all day and then we're <laughs> <laughs> then you do numbers on top of that after going through like it took us a quick second but we're very pleased where we've yes. landed <laughs> so very very pleased very very i'm actually very excited yep. okay so remember that we were all we were all in we paid 242 dollars and yep. 10 cents for this box yep. um and our potential our potential revenue after shipping and fees 
is $793. Which is exciting. It is very, very exciting. exciting. So that gives us $551 in potential profit, which is amazing. Remember we only paid $242, so we like doubled our investment like yes. after profit so that's really really good so we figured labor is going to cost us anywhere from 80 to 100 bucks so we'll say 100 bucks just for purposes which leaves us with 451 dollars wow. so we more than doubled and then we got like 200 dollars more than double so we almost tripled uh it's desi which is awesome desi's attracted <laughs> But anyways, it was awesome. It's the second box that we've got from them. We've actually got two more coming from them. Uh, both boxes have done very well. If they keep doing it, then we're gonna keep ordering more and more boxes, add that into our repertoire, uh, and it's exciting. Yeah, we're very, very excited with the outcome of this. And yeah. I, I honestly, we couldn't ask for better. So yeah. we hope you guys have enjoyed this unboxing. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're still here, please make sure you hit that subscribe button down below. We release unboxings every single week. Yeah. Um, and if you're interested to see how this stuff sells, we do also release, release yes. vlog posts twice a week. Yeah. So until next time, my friends, peace. peace.